Hello everyone, welcome back to Snape Games, which is not only a gaming channel, a tutorial channel also. I hope uh, you have gone through my previous tutorials on different softwares. So today we will learn the a most sensitive case which uh, currently I hope uh, most of YouTubers are facing that is quick rendering. Uh, Premiere Pro takes lots of time you know uh, during a important video render so today we'll learn um, about quick rendering techniques so let's go if you are new to this channel don't forget to like share and subscribe I hope you will find this video interesting so let's go so uh, let's uh, take a random video uh, which I have already no mm, selected that is a video of uh, 55.3 mb so let's uh, drag and drop to premiere pro so this is the project until section as you uh, already know so uh, let's drag it to the timeline so we are uh, now we'll uh, we'll check the video what it is so this is a render video this is a uh, uh, you can see that uh, someone's dancing on the video yeah so uh, what is our job then first we will see uh, how much after uh, putting some effects how much it will take time for render so we'll uh, go to the effects let's uh, select some render uh, random effects so we are selecting cross dissolve here so I hope this is a very common effect can nowadays uh, people are using yeah so things are going very smooth so let's just change the video sequence now so we have changed the video sequence here okay so let's reselect the cross dissolve effect here so we have selected Okay, it's saying insufficient media. No problem, bro. Okay, so let's select in a single place only. Okay. And now let's make this properly. Yeah. You can see the proper effect. Yeah, so it's done here. So let's delete uh, the another section. So here uh, we'll 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 render it normally. How we'll do? Okay. So let's go to with the short key control M mm, after that we'll select the format the maximum people are using this H264 I hope you guys know that so uh, we have same we have selected that and after that we'll uh, go for Facebook 1080 full HD video so now uh, we'll render that okay and we'll see we'll calculate the time now okay so I have given on the export and it's saying estimated uh, time remaining is uh, as you've seen that 35 33 some seconds so it's going on Just hold on uh, 34 seconds 33 seconds whatever the time uh, this video will take after that I'll show them uh, a quick technique through which you can uh, render big videos with a short duration so it's already done 63 percent 29 seconds remaining okay 
16 seconds 83 11 seconds 100% so uh, usually uh, what it takes like uh, two or three uh, seconds now we'll use uh, a different technique for rendering okay I hope you guys have already seen that uh, it has taken uh, three minutes oh, sorry almost one uh, one and a half minutes now we'll render it with a different technique okay so let's start it so now we'll uh, go to the sequence and uh, we'll go to the sequence settings so here you'll see that uh, editing mode is custom time base is 30 frames per second so we'll uh, quickly we'll change it to 25 uh, frames per second and uh, after that we'll uh, go to the video previews which is the most important section here so we'll select just hold on okay let's make it 30 and uh, we'll select the quick time and uh, in the codec mood we'll go for adobe progress 422 high quality okay we have selected and here you can select the maximum render quality but I'm gonna uncheck that because it takes the maximum time okay so um, I have now I'll press the button okay so here you will see the magic now as you know the short key for in and out selection that is I and O okay we have selected already the sequence render section and uh, now we'll go for render in out okay let me recheck again okay every all the settings are same which i have selected already so that will go for render in and out now here you'll see that uh, estimated time is one minute and uh, 25 seconds and it's going okay let's let us what was some time you can take a cup of coffee between that yeah now you can see the magic speed yeah, it's going and uh, from 90 seconds to it's down to 26 seconds in the spell of time total rendering frame is uh, 424 here I know that this is a very uh, low range of frames but I find this video interesting and I hope you are safe between this pandemic COVID situation okay uh, the thing the thing uh, you can see the green line here that means the total video is already rendered okay now we will go for the main render section and uh, here we will select the same format quick time and uh, we will select the same apple progress photo to high quality we have already selected and here it is and you can don't forget to check use previews otherwise the magic will fail now we will select the use previews and we will just click on the export now you'll see the magic here you can see the magic previously it it has taken one and a half minutes now it is it has taken only 10 seconds the render is complete so i hope uh, you guys find this video interesting i know this is a just a little bit lengthy the video is a little bit lengthy but uh, very much informative and it will save your time definitely so uh, Good night for now as I am making this video on 12.4 am in Indian Test Time. Thanks for watching.